institution. Great musician, great songwriter, and in his own unflappable way, he, he can cover every subject going from old washing machines right through to today's hot button headline topics. And uh, you learn a lot about uh, yourself and the human race when you listen to his songs. He is a uniquely gifted entertainer, and these days, He's got uh, kind of a mini string band with him, the two gentlemen on stage. I hope you recognize they've been here before in other groups and other contexts. And uh, let me just, uh, before we turn them loose here, make sure everything is letter perfect. <laughs> Mr. Bill Vernon right over here. The one and only uh, Bill Vernon. Yeah. Thank you, John. And here they are, the unique, the inimitable John Hartford and the Hartford String Band. Thank you, Bill Vernon. We're tickled to death to be here. We're tickled to death you're here. We're tickled to death to have Mike Compton with us here on the mandolin. Let's give him a big hand, if you will. Tickled to death to have Jerry McCurry on the bass. Let's give him a hand. Especially tickled to death to have this young man here adjusting this microphone. Let's give him a big hand. We're tickled to death that we're all here at the same time, which shows a great deal of coordination between production and promotion. Let's give a big hand for production and promotion. Now let's have a big hand for absolutely no reason whatsoever. just got back from Japan about six years ago. And uh, over in Japan, you get up on the stage, you say, I'm tickled to death to be here. They translate that into Japanese. It comes out, he scratches himself until he dies.
killed a rooster, she thought it was a duck. She put it on the table with his legs poking up, oh babe. About to lose my mind. Bring your clothes back home. Try me one more time. Yeah. It was a coming down the stairs, going oop, shoop, a doobie eyes, sitting there looking up, digging all that flip flop to Fooby, oh baby, yeah. About to lose my mind Bring your clothes back home And try me one more time Here we go Oh, it's in that little place right there It was the coming down the stairs going oop shoop a doobie I was sitting there looking up and digging all of that flip flop to floopy Oh yeah, worth repeating that I do 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 <laughs> Bring your clothes back home Try me one more time Kissing and loving on down, you're the dreamiest gal that I've ever been around. Oh, babe, about to lose my mind. Bring your clothes back home and try me one more time. Kissing and loving on down, you're the dreamiest gal that I've ever been around. Oh, babe, about to lose my mind. Bring your clothes back home, try me one more time. So at any rate, this guy knows that he needs to paint the house. And he hasn't got enough money to buy paint. And he goes to church, and the preacher gets up and says, we need a volunteer to paint the church. And he gets an idea. He volunteers, gets the paint, splits it in half, weakens it a little bit, paints the church, goes home and paints his house, and goes to bed. And long about the middle of the night, it starts to rain, and he goes, oh, my God, and he gets up, and he jumps up, and he looks, and he runs out. And sure enough, the rain is coming down, and the paint is streaming off the house. 
And so he gets panicked and he runs down to the church and sure enough, the same thing's happening down there. It's raining and the rain is washing all the paint off the church. And he falls down on his hands and knees and he begins to pray upward. And of course the heavens split open and a, and a voice comes down with a little ray of sunshine and says, that's all right, my son, repaint and thin no more. flowers have been but the heart beats on as warmly now as when the summer days were nigh oh the sun can never dip so low to be down in affection's cloudless sky Fast, Lorena, though mine beat faster far than thine. A hundred must was flowery May when up that hilly slope we climbed to watch the dying of the day and hear the distant church bells chime. other than Lorena, far more than we ever dared to tell, and what we might have been, Lorena, had our lovings prospered well, then tis part the years roll on, I'll not call up their shadowy form. I'll say to them lost years, sleep on, sleep on, or heat life's pelting storm.
It's knowing that your door is always open and your path is free to walk. That makes me tend to leave my sleeping bag rolled up and stashed behind your couch. And it's knowing I'm not shackled by forgotten words and bonds and ink stains that have dried upon some line. That keeps you in the back roads by the rivers of my memory. That keeps you ever gentle on my mind. It's not clinging to the rocks that ivy planted on their columns. Nothing binds me. Or something that somebody said because they thought we fit together walking. It's just knowing that the world will not be cursing or forgiving when I walk along some railroad track and find that you're waving from the back roads by the rivers of my memory. For hours, you're just gentle on my mind. All the wheat fields and the clotheslines and the junkyards and the highways come between us. And some mother woman crying to her mother cause she turned and I was gone. I still might run in silence, tears of joy might stain my face, and the summer sun might burn me till I'm blind. But not to where I cannot see you walking on the back roads by the rivers flowing gentle on my mind. Soup back from the gurgling crack of cauldrons and train yard. My beard roughing in coal pile and a dirty hat pulled low across my face. Through cup dance round a tin can, I pretend to hold you to my breast and find that you're waving from the back roads by the rivers of my memory, ever smiling, ever gentle on my. Thank John Rossbach for loaning us this guitar today. It's a fine guitar. Well, I rode away to Sears and Robot. I ordered me a silver tone. A postman brought him on a big black cost in a paper box four feet long over oh, silver tone. Silver tone blue. My baby's gone. I ain't alone. Cause I got old silver tone. Silver tone blue, silver tone guitar blue. My baby's gone, I ain't alone, cause I got my old silver tone. Well, I went to town last Saturday, down in front of Hardison's store. I made me a dollar and a dime and a quarter, and I'm going down there for a bore with my silver tone. Silver tone guitar blue. My baby's gone, I ain't alone, I got got my old silver tone, the silver tone blue, silver tone guitar blue. My baby's gone, I ain't alone, I got my old silver tone now. Silver tone blue. My baby's gone, I ain't alone. They always got my old silver tone. Silver tone blue. Silver tone guitar blue. My baby's gone, I ain't alone. Cause I got my old silver tone.
sing us some here. Working on the Illinois River, get a half a day off with pay. I'll talk about making up barges on a long, hot summer day. For every day I'm working on the Illinois River, get a half a day off with pay. I'll talk about making up barges on a long, hot summer day. Sing that with me. again forever I'll top up making up barges now clap me little rhythm here we go A man off in Beardstown. Oh, when we come down yesterday, I'm gonna get off down below the hub at a bridge on a long hot summer day. Oh, top up making up barges. Sing it again. Clap me little rhythm, here we go. Well, I put a man off in Beardstown. Summer day. Oh, top up making up barges. Sing it again. Oh, top up making up barges. Let's sing it as around all the men to sing. Ladies. That's the prettiest thing I ever heard in my life. It seemed like everybody came in the same car, they all rode in the back seat. Every day I'm working on the Illinois River, get a half a day off with pay. No top up making up. Barges big ending now on a long hot summer. Here's Jerry McCurry.
adventure When I looked up, I saw your face Sweetheart of mine, can't you hear me calling?
say it comes a rolling down the hollers of old Ireland and up the mountains of East Tennessee from back in North Carolina with Scottish tones and Indian moans and wails of railroad liners. They helped along that old time song, the boys from North Carolina. It rode and growed all in the west way out in old Missouri. And then took off around the world like lightning in its fury. There ain't no age you sound the string in major or in minor. Disappears all in the years, brings a laugh throughout the tears from the boys from North Carolina. Kentucky is the bluegrass state, her sunny skies to find her. The western slope of East Tennessee, where nothing could be finer. The northern boys that make more noise, to pick could not be finer. To make that sound and get it down, it helps if you've been around. The boy from North Carolina, how oh, they stood in line around the block, right back here at the Ryman. To hear that lick, that old mule kick from the boy from North Carolina. Gastonia to Boiling Springs from Flint Hill back to Charlotte. They tried to find the place of birth, still talking about who played it first. The boys from North Carolina. We got a little bit of time left, and uh, I'm just too damn lazy to do something showy. So we're just going to play a couple old fiddle tunes here. And there's one called Blackjack Grove. tune called Blackberry Blossom and this is not this is not the one that Arthur Smith wrote but this is Garfield's Blackberry Blossom it's supposed to be the tune that General Garfield whistled as he rode at the head of his troops as they rode up the Big Sandy River to the Battle of Middle Creek 
be that as it may. Thank you very much. We've had a wonderful time here this afternoon. We're going to be on again tonight. I'd like to close out with an old Missouri fiddle tune that I learned when I was a kid. And it's played in a lot of different versions, but I'll play the version that I know. And uh, it's called Wolves of Howlin. It's awful high, to, awful high to sing, but it's a word. Can't you hear them wolves are prowling all around you, poor little dark? You better watch out or the wolves will get you, but you know I'll never forget you. In the one on the hillside, two in the holler. I bet them wolves have done and got her. Poor little darling, poor little darling, the howling around you, poor little darling. Thank you very much, Mr. Mike Compton on the mandolin. Jerry McCurry on the bass fiddle. Thank you very much. Ladies and gentlemen, John Hartford and the Hartford String Band here at the Winterhawk Bluegrass Festival. Yes, indeed. All right. Do you want to hear one more from John Hartford? Come on, come on, come on, come on. All right, let's see what we can do here. Yeah, that's what I thought. You all certainly are easily entertained. I'm very fortunate to be able to work with my favorite mandolin player. There yonder he stands, right there. No, you. Hey, big tail, you. <laughs> I love him. I love everything about him. I love his playing. 
and he flattered me greatly by writing a tune called Hartford House, which I barely can play, but I'm going to attempt to play enough of it so that he can play this beautiful mandolin solo that he plays on this. <laughs> Thank you. 
We're told that Pete Rowan's not here yet, so if you can put up with us having fun with this PA system, why, we'll, we'll continue on here. written for the memory of the late Joe Stewart. All the roads we ran and the folks we knew, the risky things that we used to do, now it's over and I know we're through, and I wish we had our time again, I wish we had our time again, I wish we had our time again, I wish we had our, sing that chorus with me, I wish we had our, I wish we had our time again. Sing it again, I wish we Now clap me some rhythm. second verse but it'll come to me when I come back around and we'll sing it right but there's no point in starting it out right now it'll come in at the wrong place it won't make any sense so we'll just have to hang with it until it comes back around to the chorus and here we go and I wish we had our time again I wish we had our time again I wish we had our time Well, I couldn't go to sleep, got up and made a light Trying to write it down in the middle of the night Looking for the words, but it won't come right And I wish bass fiddle solo, I'll tell you what. An only man I know in Davidson County can play that tune right there, Mr. Jerry McCurry. Yeah. All right. Well, we're very honored to have Mr. Pete Kuykendall here with us today. He's the editor of Bluegrass Unlimited magazine that promotes all these events. Know about him if it wasn't for him, so let's give him a big hand. He's sitting right down here in the Bluegrass Unlimited baseball cap. Wish we had our time again. I wish we had our time again. I wish we had our time. If not for love, could hardly see. I looked at you and you looked at me. Oh, memory, love won't let me be. And I wish we had our time again. I wish we had our time again. And I wish we had our time again. I wish we had our time again. Oh, one more time. Yeah, and I wish we had our time again. Hold on, don't go anywhere, don't do anything, don't say anything, because I'll be right back and I don't want to miss anything. <laughs> Here's an old tune called The Squirrel Hunters. 
right by the biggest squirrel you'll ever meet. <laughs> Call Mr. Mike Compton around the microphone here. And let him do something that a lot of people don't hear him do, and I love to hear him do it, and I want to share it with you. That's the new age phrase, share it with you. Right? And so here's Mike Compton and his mandolin, and he will explain what he's going to do. No. Uh, this is break a sweat. No chance of that. That's a little different version of something you hear all bluegrass bands play, but this has come um, down around my part of the country, down in Mississippi. It's originally done by the Mississippi Sheiks. All right, there it is. It's the old sitting on top of the world. Don't worry, 
I'm sitting on top of the world She's gone I don't worry I'm sitting on top of the world Going down to the station All out in the yard God, I've got me a freight train Work's done got hard But now she's gone I don't worry I'm sitting on top of the world Come here running, holding out your hand I can get me a woman as quick as you got you a man But now she's gone, I don't worry I'm sitting on top of the world Now she's gone, I don't worry I'm sitting on top of the world Peter Rowan is here, and we appreciate you being a lovely audience. You're in for a rare treat coming up here on the stage. Yes, sir. I mean, and yes, ma'am, and all such as that. And want a big thank you to Mr. Mike Compton. And of course, a big thank you to Jerry McCurry. Thank you to David Greer for leaning on the stage. Yes, sir. And of course, the old bald spot on top of the head. I'd like to remind you that this show was not federally funded. And of course, Bill Vernon, give him a big hand. Yeah. All right, John Hartford and the Hartford String Band, Mike Compton and Jerry McCurry. Yeah, we're so glad you enjoyed them. And we especially want to thank John and Mike and Jerry for hanging in a whole lot of extra time because...